and we also sell through CSA, which is Community Supported Agriculture. So people um, invest in our farm, they give us the money up front, and then we uh, give them back produce throughout the season. So it's um, a way for us to meet our uh, operating costs without taking out a loan or anything. And um, it's a way for people to become more a part of the farm. So they're sharing the risk with us. So if something fails, they don't get it. <laughs> and um, two years ago, they got no cucumbers. Yeah, but it's a really good way for people to support local farms and keep them active. We have 30 acres total, but we're only growing this year. We're going to grow on about six, so we're pretty small. Um, this acreage out over here that's really, really wet is mostly just in cover crop and weeds right now. It will go into the organic certification program this year. We've just left it fallow for three years because we purchased it from conventional farmers and there's a waiting period while you wait for the soil to be cleaned up. <laughs> but it still has a long way to go. It's been, you know, truck farm, so like big, heavy trucks drove from the yeah. soil. Which for an organic farmers, they <laughs> have these big, heavy trucks and like, oh my gosh. Ah. So this spring cover crop, uh, most likely oats and peas. <laughs> so rotation just sort of is, you know, the idea you, you don't plant the same thing in the same mm -hmm. place year after year after year. So this is the most of the growing area. We'll see this will be our fifth year in production. Um, and then we have another field on the other side of those sequoias. And then there's another one acre field um, that was in vetch over on the side of the barn that we'll grow on for this year. I think we should sing a song while we work. <laughs> with a better understanding of where food comes from and what goes into producing it. Uh, and that we haven't done much of the animal part. We should clean out the barn, the goat barn next time. That would be really good and stinky fun work. There's lots of poop in there. And it's like deep litter, makes the best compost. But yeah, go pee stinks. But, yeah. But it makes wonderful compost and then wonderful things grow from it. And